Thanks for tuning in to Nutrition's Guide to Transition to the Upgraded Neocate Junior. A great technique to help increase the likelihood of acceptance of a new formula is called transitioning, or sometimes referred to as fading. Fading is a technique that works by gradually mixing a small amount of something new into something that has already been accepted. Gradually, the percentage of the new formula is increased until the transition is complete. The goal of fading is acceptance of the new combination, even if the difference is noticeable. Remember that forward progress is an accomplishment. So let's take a look at the upgraded Neo Kate Jr. Some people may notice a change in taste, color, texture, and smell, so it's important not to rush the transition. The transition period varies on an individual basis, and a slower transition is perfectly fine. For most, the change will be simple and likely not need a transition period. However, for some, it might take a few days. Remember, once you have made the switch to the upgraded Neo Kate Jr., don't go back to the previous formula. If you or your child is experiencing difficulties transitioning, contact your healthcare provider. We've created a guide to help you during the transition process. You can find this transition guide on our website. Okay, now let's work through an example of fading together. We'll be using a four-step fading technique that gradually increases the amount of the new formula by two ounces each day over a four-day period. For the first step, let's prepare the previous formula based on the instructions on the can. Remember, you can keep the formula for up to 24 hours in the refrigerator after it's mixed, so you can use it the next day. Now it's time to prepare the upgraded formula. We've simplified the mixing, so now it's a one-to-one -one ratio using one fluid ounce of water with just one scoop of powder. Now we're ready to begin fading. For our example, if using an eight ounce glass, simply fill the glass with six ounces of the previous Neo Kate Jr. and two ounces of the upgraded Neo Kate Jr. Then mix the two formulas together. On day two, fill the glass with four ounces of each of the formulas and mix. On day three, you can increase to six ounces of the upgraded Neo Kate Jr. and only two ounces of the previous and mix to combine. At last, on day four, use eight ounces of only the upgraded formula. If accepted, you have been successful in transitioning from the previous to the upgraded formula. We hope you are as excited as we are about the upgraded Neo Kate Jr. As always, be sure to work with a member of your healthcare team if you have any questions related to the transitioning process.